Bud Kirchner in our Summer Classics series, a reprise from Entrepreneurs, the Dobson series. And in that series, an entrepreneurship mentor has the last word. Here it is. I really like the man, uh, probably because he's real. I liked him a lot. Uh, and when I say he's real is because I find him having uh, a good approach. He's uh, using fundamental values. He's honest. His approach is based on the people in the business. So his approach is a bit different than what we normally do when it comes a time for people to fix companies having problems. And I find him very endearing because I notice when he talks about uh, his success, he always uses the word we instead of I. So th his success is a team success. So it's very important, I believe. He al also has a very good um, approach. He is very disciplined in his approach. He uses the same model all the time. Um, and in his approach, he uses a long-term view, which distinguishes himself, again, from uh, the others. Uh, he's there to help the companies uh, to find the solutions to their problem and he doesn't run away. He stays there, he has or maintained a, a small uh, investment, 10 to 15 percent, so he does care about the success of the company. But also he leaves the management take ownership of the future of the company and I believe it's very uh, uh, a significant part of his success. He's really uh, uh, working on the ground, like he likes to visit the companies, he doesn't do it from his office. He goes on the ground, he visits the companies, he wants to see with his eyes and feel really how the company works and how he can help them to solve uh, the problems. Um, so effectively a good part uh, of his uh, uh, success is because he's using the good fundamental values. It's quite inspiring to hear him talking about the foundation, uh, the Eden Angel Foundation is the name of his foundation. And um, when he talks about it, it's very convincing. We see that he cares about helping the kids. He's very, uh, um, he really wants to help the society, to give back to society. Uh, so when he talks about his weeks, the highlight of his weeks, uh, he said that it's when he reads about the progress of the kids that go through the program that he and his foundation support. And he's really proud of it. So not only he gives back to the society in terms of fixing companies, but also in, uh, by helping the kids uh, overcoming the, the barriers that they, they have because of their sickness. Bud Kirchner, a reprise from Entrepreneurs of the Dobson series. The man you're about to meet has won Entrepreneur of the Year twice. I don't think anyone else has ever done that. He is famous for being a company doctor, for rescuing organizations that nobody wants to touch as they sink slowly into the abyss, pulls them up out of there, fixes them up, and prepares them again to function in the market properly. And yet he's always done that with high ethics, without the kind of greed that you have seen too much of on Wall Street. At the same time, with his wife Sandra, he started a foundation devoted to hidden angels. And we touched on both topics. Here, once again, is Bud Kirchner of Alabama. 